suggest that when your child is around the age of eight, that you start making homework diary sheets. Please make two of them with your child and on the homework diary sheet, you would put the day that the child gets given their homework, like let's say on a Monday evening, it's maths and tables. And then the day that the actual maths homework or the maths table test is taking place. Then in between, make sure that you write in the days to do the tables test as a, again with the spelling, the same thing, so that it gets done each night before the spelling test. Otherwise, the tendency is, is to forget about it and only remember the spelling test day and the maths table test. And then there's a mad rush on Thursday evening to get everything done for the two tests on the, on the Friday morning. The trouble about that is that they might get them completely right on the Friday morning, but two weeks later, they've probably forgotten them. So it's better that they spend each evening doing a little bit to help them remember it better. And as well, if there's a 20 minute reading per night is actually to write it on the sheet so that then you can actually discuss with your child what they've actually been reading and encourage them to keep the reading up every single night. Round about the age of eight, your child may want to work on their own in their room. Before that, they'll probably be with you in the kitchen, but it may take as long as till the child's 10 to want to do that. So it's that's variable depending on your child. And if your child wants to work on their own, please make sure that the lighting uh, in their room is adequate and also that it's quiet and peaceful so that they can settle down to do their homework. The other thing to check as well is the homework bag that they bring back from school. It's worth checking it a couple of times a week because otherwise you might find a note that's for you in the school bag and you haven't seen it for several weeks. And also it's an opportunity to tidy out and put in a folder any loose pieces of paper that are about a subject that they've brought home. So. Um, Hopefully this will help you with making sure that they've taken everything into school um, on the days they should, including things like the PE kit or their swimming cl clothes, swimsuit if they need to on another day so you don't have to go to the school later on and bring it. Thank you for listening. Oh my God, in the, in the final... <laughs>